Who was your favorite teacher? What's the first name that pops up in your mind when I ask this question? It was probably not that teacher that overloaded you with facts and figures and theories. It was that teacher that touched you intellectually and emotionally. In this video, I will share how telling stories touches and helps you create classes that will be remembered. My name is Mion van Opijnen. I help you teach with ease and impact without exhausting yourself. This is video three of a series of five where I explore the power of social engagement for making your online classes active and fun. Before I say more, let me ward off a general idea of stories. It's not about making a up a fairy tale to seduce your listener. It's a tool to involve and touch your listener. Bringing content alive makes it easier to understand and apply. I remember I once had to give a presentation about a computer and I found it very difficult to grasp and to, um, and I found it very abstract until my dad explained that there was that little man walking around in a computer going from drawer to drawer and when I needed the information again it would take it out of the drawer and bring it back to me. And the computer really came alive to me. And that picturizing the computer in that way still helps me today in finding my way in new technological developments. The story my dad told me made an appeal on my intellectual and emotional brain. And as science proves, if we are able to bring theories alive through telling stories, it lights up the emotional brain of the listener. So more active, active neurological paths in our brain will help us to better memorize. Like this little man that made paths to have access to the stored knowledge. I can hear you think, my content is not suitable for stories, or I'm not the person for telling stories. But I tell you, everybody can tell stories. And sharing these doubts how to make your content come alive is already a story in itself. Stories humanize, and when you share your struggles with the theory and views on it, students will recognize their own struggles in you. It will make you more approachable as a teacher, and the theory will be easier to grasp. Give it a go and experience how this can help you putting less effort in the online engagement of your students. Share a personal story in relation to the content, how you struggled with it, or what sparked your enthusiasm. I'm curious and share in the comments below how you bring your content alive. And if you like this and you want to know more about creating fun and active online classes, subscribe yourself to this channel and also press the bell so that you will be notified when I'm posting the next video. So see you in my next video.